Good morning everyone, it's Ron from Project Power TDI, otherwise known as Ron Rake, good friend on the T4 forums on Facebook. It's Monday the 26th of June 2023 and I'm on my way to Newcastle to meet one of my most recent customers who has fitted a groundbreaking 250 horsepower VNT turbo kit and has achieved 244 horsepower with 510 newton meters of torque and I can't wait to have a go in this van. Now, I was told about four years ago by a certain popular remapping person, company, whatever you want to call them, they phoned me up and shouted down the phone and started to tell me not to spread pub talk figures about what I could achieve with a 2.5 TDI. Back at that time, we were talking about 170 horsepower. Well, today we're talking about 244 horsepower. We are the first company to produce a bolt-on hardware kit that can achieve that kind of power. So that remapping company can now eat their words. I can't wait to have a go in man and feel what 244 horsepower feels like in a T4. I can't wait and I'll be taking you guys with me. Right, we're with our customer in his golf, about to take a trip to go and see the T4. Look at that mileage. And I love his start button. Well, we're here. This is it. This is the 250 horsepower rocket for a ride in this machine. There it is. The engine. It's about to see the turbo as well. My GT3 TV. Nice half pipe kit. Down to the intercooler. AXG airbox and mass airflow sensor. Looking good to me, guys, with three inch exhausts with the PMP gauge sensor. Right, we're finally in the van. This is a copy of the power run, the dyno run. And what have we got here? 244 horsepower and 516 newton meters, not 510. But look at that curve, it's beautiful. So we're gonna give it a bit of stick next and see how it feels. So we're just driving slowly around town and even at 244 horsepower, it's a pussycat. Let's see what it's like when we get onto a long stretch. All right, we're gonna give it a little bit of stick in second and third gear. Fucking hell. Customer just gave it a little bit of stick in second and third and a little bit in fourth and I, it just threw me back in the seat. It's unbelievable. By comparison to my 280 horsepower T5, this, uh, it's just more raunchy. It's more mechanical, more aggressive. It's beautiful. Here we go, overtaking time. a very well-known uh, performance parts and tuning shop uh, in the north of England have achieved 300 and something horsepower with a T4 but it's smoked like a train. This does not smoke and the power is awesome. Let me tell you what else guys, this is a full camper. Look in the back, meaning it's got a shitload of weight and it still flies. Proper power run guys, private road. Here we go. Straight it up. 
describe that. I'll leave it to you guys. This is just absolutely fantastic. because the gear knob doesn't have numbers on it anymore but we're cruising in fifth gear at 30 miles an hour okay fifth gear 30 miles an hour thing is a pussycat when you want it to be a pussycat and it's an absolute cheater when you want it to go safari it's orgasmic i've got no other way to describe how this vehicle is making me feel here we go again Right, well we're just back from our trip in this beast what can i say it's 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 sex it's raunchy it's orgasmic it pulls like a fucking beast I mean, look at this guys it's not even breaking the sweat we're up to 120 miles an hour on a private road in a matter of seconds it's fantastic no hesitation boosts from 1500 rpm this turbo is an absolute winner look how small it is and it makes 250 horsepower the next one i think is going to make more like 300 horsepower just looking at the back of the vehicle there's absolutely no evidence of oil smoke soot nothing it's clean <laughs> 